at KCAL News, uh, we have been very worried since yes. the week, and we've been thinking a lot about our friend, our colleague, Alyssa Carlson. Yeah, ever since we heard that Alyssa fainted on air Saturday morning and taken to the hospital, we've been worrying about her. She is okay. Yeah. She is recovering, and Alyssa does have a heart condition, but her doctor says she was not having a heart attack, which is great news. Earlier this morning, she talked on CBS Mornings about what her doctor says may have happened. There's a thing called vasovagal syncope, mm. and that is the condition that I have. I do have a history of fainting. Um, it's just when you're on a public platform, sometimes it happens and people now see this. So it hadn't happened in a while, and I'm now going to have to learn how to really recognize the symptoms of this condition. Vaso is blood vessel. Mm -hmm. And vagal refers to the vagus nerve. And if the vagus nerve is overstimulated or inappropriately stimulated, the pulse rate can go down and the blood pressure goes down and uh, not enough blood goes up to the head and you can faint. And we saw with Alyssa, she was sort of propped up so she couldn't go flat. Yeah. And then eventually she went flat. That's Dr. John oh. LaPook there, obviously uh, breaking down that condition. But uh, so grateful that Alyssa is okay and has understanding yeah. about what's going on. For and her. it is scary because, like she said, she can faint anywhere. But if you're by a sharp surface yes. or a hard surface, that's yeah. where the real dangers also come in. So, Alyssa, good. And keep eating that pizza. She said she was relaxing, <laughs> eating pizza, watching good for movies you. Yes. with her daughter and husband. KCAL 9 is now KCAL News. CBS News Los Angeles, your local news, streaming wherever, whenever.